Here's how you can make this threshold photo effect super fast and super easy in Kittle. So I've got a poster size 16 by 20 artboard open. Doesn't really matter what canvas size you're using. Uh, I'm just gonna change my background color to white for now. And we're gonna go to photos. For this, I'm going to type in, uh, let's say camera. I wanna do a threshold of a camera. And I'm gonna scroll until I find something that I think is cool. I really like this vintage Polaroid camera, so we're gonna size this up. I'm gonna use our handy background removal tool to get rid of this white portion. So now we have just the camera already looking super cool. I'm gonna go ahead and crop this as well before we vectorize it. And the threshold effect comes from vectorizing the image. So we're gonna go over to our image vectorizer tool. We're gonna to keep the color on one and click vectorize image. So now we have a thresholded effect version of this picture. The super cool thing is it is vector, so you can scale it without pixel loss as well as change the color to anything that you like. So if I wanna change the background color to something else, and my photo doesn't really match, I can just change the color of it. But well, there's your threshold effect. It's super fast, super easy. Go have fun with this. Give us a like and a comment. If you're not subscribed to the channel and you wanna stay updated and get more design tips just like this one, hit that subscribe button and we'll see you in the next one. Peace.